Did you hear that Doug Ford said, if he gets elected on June 7th, he'll stop the $15 minimum wage before it comes in? Yeah, I heard that too. But he said he's going to give tax cuts to people making less than $30,000 a year. And I think that's really going to help me out. It's actually not good at all, though. Most people who earn less than $30,000 don't pay taxes because of already existing tax deductions and credits. Doug Ford's plan would mean that people would lose their $15 minimum wage and they won't even benefit from a tax cut. Okay, but a lot of people making minimum wage do pay tax, especially if they work full time. So how does this affect them? Well, say you're a minimum wage earner. With Ford's tax cut, you'd only get about $800. But if you work full time at $15 an hour, you'd earn about $1,900. It's definitely a better deal than Ford's tax cut. Hmm, Ford's plan sounds like a bad deal. It is, and it gets worse. Because if our wages stay low, so will our pensions, our employment insurance, and even termination pay. Wow, I hadn't even thought about those things. Me neither. I'm really glad we talked. I think I've changed my mind about how I'm going to vote, and I'm going to talk to my friends and coworkers too. Same here. I'm definitely not voting for Doug Ford. 